gotta stay low key. I gotta stay low key. I gotta stay low key. You gotta stay low key. Hey guys, so I'm back. I'm gonna be doing a hair review today. This hair that I have on my head at the moment is from DY Hair, and this is their Body Wave hair and this is actually one of their newer products and this is the 360 lace band frontal so yes this is a 360 lace band frontal and these have been all over youtube of course i had to see what it was for myself and give it a try the frontal and i also have three bundles i have 22 inch 20 inch 18 inch and the frontal is 16 inches so i do have almost all three bundles in. I did make this into a wig. Um, I didn't record it because I just followed off someone else's video, but I don't want to take credit for her work. So of course I can link the video in the description box if you're interested in how I made this unit, but of course you can also get it sewn down, but I just prefer wigs now because I am natural ever since I big chop. I just want to be able to tend to my natural hair whenever I need to and whenever I want to wash it, I could do so. So that was that. I did sew on a elastic band from ear to ear. Basically, I measured it from the back of my head from ear to ear and that and I just sewed it on from each part. Each, I just sewed it to each size of the frontal and I also have two combs that I sewn in the back at the bottom just to keep it from lifting. In the back this hair it took about three days i believe to be shipped and it was shipped by dhl and i got the hair and it came in this little bag right here i love when they send little bags like this or just the little zip bags because i can keep my hair in here especially since i made it into a wig it's really great i can store it in here when i'm not using it so i like that and it also came in the little individual plastic bags i opened it up um, the hair did not smell at all. Um, I ran my fingers through and there was no shedding. I can run my fingers through right now. And I got like one strand and that's it. I did bleach the knots. This is my first time bleaching knots, period. I normally just put foundation on my closures and frontals and keep it pushing. But when I tried to do that, it didn't really work out, so I didn't like it. So I ended up rinsing the foundation out and I went out and bought some bleach and, you know, the developer and all that good stuff. And the lady and Sally, she helped me pick out some shampoo and it was supposed to like help so the hair won't be damaged or if the hair did get damaged, it would help repair it. So I used that and it went pretty well. I was afraid that the bleach was going to leak through the lace and um, bleach the hair, but it didn't um it didn't do that so i was like really happy that that didn't happen for my first try and i did not have any like brown hair dye at the house but i did have some tea bags and it was late when i was doing it so i just used that i seen that you could do that and i just let it soak overnight and it actually worked pretty pretty well of course if you get a frontal you're gonna have to customize it yourself and you know do all the pluck plucking and all of that but of course you can also get your hairstylist to do so so you don't have to do all the work so of course i did pluck the hairline i did okay i feel like i still need more more practice but yeah i did okay and you are you are supposed to be able to pull this hair back if you want so yeah you see it's pretty secure down and i use the got to be glued method so yeah i decided to jump on the bandwagon everyone else was using it so i decided to give it a try i got the one in the black bottle it's the invisible one in the black tube and also got the freeze spray and i used that and it worked pretty well i'd rather use this hair gel use the hair gel over than using hair glue because i care about my edges okay <laughs> but yeah that's really it about this hair i believe i don't think i left anything out if I did and you didn't get none of your questions answered, then just comment that down below. Thumb this video up and if you're not subscribed to my channel, then make sure that you subscribe.